Okay, let's make a video about the inverse property of multiplication. So here uh, we have some examples. Uh, 1 over 5 times 5 over 1. So basically what we did is we flip the fraction. That's what's called the inverse. So, and, and the answer will be 1 because 1 times 5 is 5. 5 times 1 is 5 and 5 over 5 is 1. So once you multiply any fraction by the flip of the same fraction the answer will be one okay also when you multiply for example in this case you have one over eight times eight but this eight is the same as eight over one okay and and that's the the inverse you have here one over eight and then you flip it it will be eight over one but we don't have to put the one we just put the eight that's also equal one now it doesn't have to be all the time one involved it could be 4 over 15 times 15 over 4 that's also the inverse so the answer would be 1 because this 4 you simplify with the 4 the 15 you simplify with the 15 and that will be 1 times 1 1 1 times 1 1 1 over 1 it's 1 okay so here's some exercise to complete for example this one also parentheses means multiplication so this is the same example as 1 over 8 times 8 so this is like 3 over 1 is the inverse we are multiplying so the answer will be 1 here 1 over 12 12 over 1 we had it in the example the answer will be also 1 here the same this is 25 is like 25 over 1 it's the inverse so the answer will be 1 3 over 7 times 7 over 3 the answer will be 1 this is very useful when we are solving equations and working with fractions let's check this 7 over 5 times 5 over 7 the same we simplify and, and it's a flip so it's basically one you don't need to do calculations when you're doing this also work for big numbers and also for variables 12 over 131 times 131 divided by 12 that would be also one and in this case the answer is not one because we are not flipping the same fractions notice that when you flip 11 over 5 it should be 5 over 11 and we have 13 over 11 so we simply 5 the 11 with the 11 that's 1 and 1 and the answer will be 13 over 5 so in this case it's not a 1 because we are not doing the inverse property we are multiplying two fractions but they are not the same fractions so i hope this video uh, helped you and have a great day god bless you always